Matchup it is as Josh Koscheck, one of the other competitors on the original Ultimate Fighter, takes the fight on two weeks notice, replacing Diego Sanchez and set to face one of the baddest men on the planet at 170, Tiago the Pitbull Alves. We want to find out who the number one contender is. Well, guess what? Fighting Tiago is one little pit stop. I got a goal, and I got a goal to become the UFC welterweight champion. And I won the belt, and I'm gonna keep the belt for a long time. Tiago is pretty much a striker. Down goes to Souza. I have the ability to fight the fight wherever I want. He's gonna try to take me down, and every time he try to do something throw a punch, a kick, or shoot for a takedown, he's gonna pay for it. The more that I'm in the cage, the better I'm gonna get. That's a guarantee. Josh Koscheck absolutely rocked him. Something crazy is gonna happen, and I'm pretty sure it's gonna hurt. I have nothing to lose. I'm gonna let it all hang out. I'm gonna make him pay until he can take anymore that I'm gonna take him out and knock him out. I hate to lose more than I love to win. I'm coming at you. I predict that this fight ends either me submitting him or knocking him out. At the end of the night, you know, my hand's gonna be raised and that's what's gonna happen. It's time to fight, man.
so I ain't no drama. What's up, what's up, what's up? I'm leaning, got put the lean in my car. Waiting at 171, oh my, Joe, oh good cut, made way, and ready to go like he's never been before. And I'll tell you what, he's not 170 right now. You're talking about a young man that cuts a substantial amount of weight. It is Josh Koscheck, greatly improved with the striking game, who has the three-inch reach advantage. With the official introductions, once again, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the co-main event of the evening. And now, three rounds of fighting in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a freestyle fighter, holding a professional record of 13 wins with two losses. Standing five feet, 10 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Fresno, California, Josh Koscheck! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 21 wins with four losses. Standing five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 171 pounds. Fighting out of Coconut Creek, Parada. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon is David Smith. Dr. David Smith, our referee. Pitbull against Kosh. Josh Koscheck, Tiago Alves. Are you ready? Are you ready? Let's go! Here we go! Co main event of the evening. Red and black trunks for the South Ball. Uh, pardon me for Tiago Alves. Tiago Alves. Red trunks, black trunks for Josh Koscheck. Man, his striking looked greatly improved at Koscheck's Joe in the fight against Dustin Hazlett. Absolutely. You know, Koscheck is, uh, he's just a super athlete. He's one of those guys that's going to get great at anything he does as long as he puts his effort and focus to it. And he has put a tremendous amount of effort and focus to his striking. Oh, he slipped. Went for a side kick. Slipped. When Joe Silva called with the opportunity to cost check, he said, let me, you know, hitting in his camp said, let me go hard. Let me go hard for an hour or so, see really where I am. Cardio felt great, he said, boom, call back, ready to go, and here he is tonight. So big credit to Josh Koscheck. displayed by Josh Koscheck. That was a statement by Tiago Alves, though. And looking to answer now is Koscheck. He's going to be much more conservative now. He's going to move away. 
The question is, now that he's been rocked, will he look for the takedown? Will Koscheck look to utilize his great wrestling? Or will he stand in exchange? Combination by Koscheck. He's recovered. Well, it's, you know, we're, we don't know how much he's recovered. That, that could have taken a substantial amount out of him. We really don't know until we see him get hit again. Okay, he appears to be recovered. How's <laughs> yeah. that? But you know what? He's, he's, a, he's a strong competitor. He's going to put on a poker face. Superman punch. Heck oh. Oh. Looking for the body is Koscheck. Jam right Koscheck. Question is too, will Tiago Alves open up and kick? with the danger of the takedown by Josh Koscheck. That's just a quick little snap kick. But will he tee off on the leg as we've seen him do against so many opponents before? There he does. Yep. Superman punch again, followed up with a left hand. Good job, guys. Koscheck landed a right hand. Josh Koscheck. Leg kick by Tiago. Inside. He's leg using kick. those over and over again, which means to me that he's looking for a big shot. Jab, leg kick, jab, leg kick. The way he does that, he's looking for something big. Koscheck really looking to, you know, change his levels and punish the midsection. Uh, Pitbull. good as any in the game, the, the late kicks of Tiago Alves. And again, we were talking about before, the Alessio fight is a perfect example of that, of, of how good his leg kicks are. Koscheck landed a good right hand there. Tiago's moving away. Nice body shot. Got a leg. Late kicks break down takedowns. And that is what Tiago Alves would like to do, Joe. He'd like to break down that front leg of Koscheck, make it very difficult for him to look to shoot. Yeah, it makes it very difficult to do anything. He can't move as well. Koscheck has got some of the best takedowns in the game. And he's, you hear his corner saying, turn it. Good defense by Tiago. Very nice. 42 0, Koscheck, national champion wrestler in 2001. Heck it. I think we can safely say Koscheck's fully recovered now, Mike. Looks up at the clock, Joe, 30 seconds. Man, he got rocked. And nice again. Leg kick. It's like swinging an axe, man. I mean, the way he swivels those hips Is into that it, work? that's textbook. Yeah, beautiful technique. And he does it in, with such short motion. He doesn't wind up. You know, it's, it's very difficult to see coming. 10 seconds. Now remember, it was that switch kick that was wicked against Dustin Hazlett. So watch for that from Koscheck. Good first round, great recovery by Koscheck. Yeah, that just shows you what kind of heart and what kind of a competitor Josh Koscheck How is. What did he hit you with? He hit with the hand. Well, don't worry about what he hit you with. What I want you to worry about is, I want movement, Josh. Okay. You know, I need fast movement. I got you. You're faster than he is. Keep but on I don't, fast. But keep the, aggressive. Look, Josh, Ones and twos, put them together. Yes. All right? Let's see. I, I want you to be I, in front want, of his face. I don't want the lower. I, don't, I want your upper body. Left hook. Let's see it again. He really didn't even turn it over. It was almost like a slap. He landed with the, the, the palm face area of it, but that just shows you what kind of power he has. And he landed it in the perfect spot. Ariani here tonight, set for round two. Let's go! Alves, Koscheck, second round. how he snaps that inside leg kick, Joe. There's nothing that's going to end the fight, but it sure can set some things up. Looking for the uppercut, Koscheck. You got to give it to Koscheck, even though he got caught in that first round. He is not gun shy. Well, you, 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 it was displayed on the Ultimate Fighter that he is he is as as athletic as anybody 
in the game today. And Joe, you pointed out, if he works hard at something, he's going to get good at it. He's been doing it his whole life. He's throwing his right hand like a fastball. Nice leg kick by Tiago. Koscheck is not looking for the takedown. Happy to stand in exchange. See that time he set up the left hand with that inside leg kick. Superman punch. Koscheck used the switch kick. The head kick to end the night of Dustin Hazlett. Koscheck, he's always a character. Relishes the role of being the bad guy, even though he's actually a good guy. But he's like, you know what? Just spell my name right, baby. Say whatever you want. Just put me in the paper, watch me, and love me or hate me. I'm going to come, and I'm going to keep on coming. Yeah, you know, if you watch the all... Throws the knee to Koscheck. If you watch the... Throws the spinning back kick. If you watch the countdown show, you know, he really talks about how when he was on nice knee to the bottom of Koscheck. He really talked about how conscious he is of, of getting his name out there and, you know, how when he was on The Ultimate Fighter, he was behaving badly a lot of times just so that people remembered him and then he got a lot of camera time. And he was good at it. Very good at it. You, you hear the boos when they introduce him. Just over two minutes old. Round two, fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Tiago turns him around, and he's got him up against the cage, and they're free. Tiago, good head movement by Tiago Alves. Nice oh, leg kick. One. That, that one was, was the thud. Yeah. The thud, as we've said over and over again, is the one that really leaves a mark. See if Koscheck looks for work, guys. another combination, or he might switch to that left kick again. Turn by Koscheck. Tiago stalking him. See, Joe, that's what we were talking about earlier. He, now he's setting that left hand up it, with that little snap and that inside leg kick. Nice uppercut by Tiago. You know, Tiago was working on a game plan for Diego Sanchez oh, for weeks. That leg kick is brutal. Oh! He's really turning it on here, Mike. The one thing Tiago Alves does, and it's very visible, is he turns the head. Anthony Hardon might have the best textbook swivel hip, the way he punishes the legs. And Tiago Alves is right there on the, the you know, leg kick 101 chart. Yeah, he might be second. I do, I do agree. Hardon has the best leg kicks. He's just got that technique. Ernesto Hu style. Yeah, yeah. Just, just digging that shin into the meat of the thigh. The more whippy you can be, the looser it is, the more punishment it can impose on your opponent. There's shot. the first shot. He's got one with 105 remaining in the round. Good takedown defense so far by Tiago. Foot stop. And notice how uh, Koscheck is not letting Tiago control his wrist. On, Tiago wants work, to guys. grab a hold Come of Koscheck's on. wrist, but instead, on, Koscheck grabs Tiago's. See how Tiago keeps reaching for that wrist? If he can control that wrist, he can stop the takedown. Just push the, push the hand away, Come on, keep guys. it from grabbing a hold Show of his ankles. 21 and 4. 25 fights in his mixed martial arts career at the young age of 25 for Tiago Alves. 30 seconds left in the round. Nice, uh, nice exchange there. Josh got him to defend, and he went to defend. He immediately got a body lock on him. But Tiago got an underhook on that left side, and that's or his right side rather, and that's what's keeping him Come out. On guys, let's work off. Come on, let's the get out. The underhook keeps him standing. Very impressive takedown seconds, defense by guys. Tiago, considering how good a wrestler Koscheck is. Two rounds in the books. Joe, we talked about it a moment ago. Textbook. Swivel, the axe, the kicks. Oh, over and over and over again. Look at those, Mike. Oh. Those hurt just watching them. Can you relax hey, for me and while you're doing it? Not so much body with the right. I want the I want the right to the head. Okay? Yep. We need combos and we need them. We need them. All right? You, you got to mix it. We got to we got to put them away. You got to put them away. 
We gotta put him away. Here's Corner. We need a knockout. They know that he's lost both the first rounds. Do it. The first round, definitely because of that punch. I mean, that was the most significant event in the first round. And the second round was Stay all those leg kicks. He's right. Because only he got the angle. He's right. Come on, my future. Okay. When I say stay with him, control him. Get, get your position. Okay. We've said it before about Tiago Alves, a rare American top teamer that was really Muay Thai first, Joe, and then excelled in his Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu game. Out, touch him up. Step all the way back, brothers. Third and final round. Let's go. Let's go! Alves from Fortaleza, Brazil. Koscheck is going to be headhunting, guaranteed. Does not want to lose. Listens to his corner. He knows that he's behind. And Tiago's turning it on. Side head kick. You have to have the ability. Let's take a look at it. And Koscheck's even holding his hand. I think he jammed his finger. Yeah. Oh, man. Well, you know what? Right He's holding it. It looked like a thumb. Let me Let me take a look at that again. It's. 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 it's it was hard to see on that angle in the slow mo, but it looked like a thumb. Time, man. Great show of respect and class. Josh Koscheck apologizing. Just as Tiago Alves did a moment ago. Just over 90 seconds remains in the fight. Leg kick. Tiago's left eye is swelling. 
swelling up, Mike. Good thing for him that this is the final minutes of the last round. Look at Tiago. from those kicks, isn't it? Yes, absolutely. Again, oh, and again. I'll tell you what, though, he's still in there. Again, again. Beautiful overcut, a left hook combination. Koscheck, Koscheck is so game, though. Look at him. Wow. Eats a leg kick, goes right back in. Eats a hook. Look at Josh, Josh knows, he knows. You see the expression on his face there, Joe? Yeah, he's disappointed, but I think at this point he realizes there's not much he can do. You know what? He's, he's disappointed, but he's got nothing to shape. He's still attacking. Look at him. Such a competitor, you know? Great fight. That's it. That's the bell. That's it. Time, time. Great fight. He didn't even hear. I was so loud in here because of that combination. I would have been right as the horse sounded. Right. Koscheck relaxed and there's yeah. a hey. Well, he knew it was over and the ref jumped in nicely. Good job done. Phenomenal performance by Tiago Alves. Great heart displayed. Great chin and great heart displayed by Koscheck. But man, the story of this fight was the leg kicks by Tiago Alves and the brutal knee that Koscheck took in that last round as well. Let's take a look at this knee. Look at this here. Up. Boom! Tiago Alves, man, what a destroyer this kid is turning out to be at 170. Watch how he turns his hip over into this leg kick. Just look at that. The, the foot is turned to the side. The meat of the leg just gets hammered with that shin. That was a great look at the replay, too. You see that front foot turns quickly. Alves unloads. Phenomenal hard displayed by Josh Koscheck, though. Josh, beautiful. You want the hat? Tiago Alves saying he thinks he broke his thumb. My, don't you know that? ATT, baby. ATT, American top team. Get him ready. Josh Koscheck and AKA. The American Kickboxing Academy with Crazy Bob Cook and the boys in Fresno. A part of me in San Jose, Josh calls Fresno home. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecards for decision. Kevin Caldwell scores the contest 30-27. Cheryl Clancy has it 29-28. And James Goodman scores the bout 30-27, declaring the winner by unanimous decision, T. But you know what? Give some serious love to Josh Koscheck. Right, Here's Joe. I'm here with the winner, Tiago Pitbull Alves. Tiago, you were originally slated to fight Diego Sanchez. Last minute replacement, Josh Koscheck, who might even be more dangerous in stopping and beating him. You've got to be happy with your performance. I'm really happy, you know. Hands up to Josh Koscheck, to the fight in Chernobyl, uh, Chernobyl you know, two weeks. Through water, man. Give me a really hard time, you know. And I'm really excited, bro. Really excited to be here and you know, just do my job and uh, looking forward for what next. Now, you were asking for a title shot before your last fight when you stopped former UFC Hall of Famer Matt Hughes. You've got to be thinking at this point in time, after a dominating performance like that over Koscheck, next must be a title shot. Do you fans want to see that? I would love to fight for the title shot. Dan White, Mr. Dan White, I'm sorry. I'm still a good boy. So please, hook me up, give me a title shot. Well, impressive performance, very impressive. We look forward to seeing you, hopefully next time for a shot at the title. Tiago Pitbull Alves, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, I just want to dedicate this victory to my conditioning coach, to all my training partners. No, Banky, I love you, that's for you. We know Marcus, we know what we got through, and thank all my sponsors. Malky, you're the man, thanks for everything. Tiago Alves.